Okay, today we're going to add some functions here together. Um, so the notation that you'll see is we've got our function f of x, which is x plus 2, and our function g of x, which is 3x. And so we want to take f plus g of x. So that just simply means that we're going to take f of x, and we're going to add it to g of x. So then we simply replace, and why don't I color code this a little bit, and add it to g of x. So f of x is x plus 2, and g of x is 3x. And then we add the two together. So we have x plus 3x, which is 4x, and then we have plus 2. And so that is what f plus g of x means. We end up with just x, 4x plus 2. So looking at another example here, so we've got these two functions. So f of x is equal to 3x squared plus 7x. g of x is equal to 2x squared minus x minus 1. And again, we want to add the functions. So I'm going to take my first one, f of x, which is 3x squared plus 7x. And I'm going to add it to g of x, which is 2x squared minus x minus 1. <clears throat> Combine my like terms. I've got a 3x squared plus a 2x squared, which is 5x squared. I have a 7x minus x, which is going to be a plus 6x. And then I have just my minus 1 on the end. And so by adding them, I just take the common or like terms, and I add the like terms together and bring down the non-like terms. <clears throat>